Does Subnautica Below Zero rise above the original? Some of the wildlife down here is very grabby. Definitely, and in more ways than one. This open-world adventure sequel stars an explorer trying to survive in an alien and sometimes hostile world. Stop right there, Altera. You're on my turf. Rather than making hunting and killing the priority, gameplay focuses on exploration, crafting, and survival. It also involves thoughtful investigation around a mysterious disappearance. Though largely unseen due to the first-person view, our protagonist Robin is a great role model. She's black, female, smart, courageous, and determined to succeed. The research is in everything. It is to me. As for violence, Robin has a knife to fend off creatures that may attack if provoked, but things never get scary or graphic. Common Sense says Subnautica Below Zero is fine for kids 10 and up, and we've named it a Common Sense selection. For top picks and advice to fit your family, visit us at commonsensemedia.org.